Yo, New York Yankee Saints, how's it going? Yet again, it is Felix from NYNews.com returning from a one-month hiatus due to the fact that YouTube wanted to rob my pockets and demonetized this channel for a month. They said that my content wasn't original when everybody knows that NY News has the most original content on YouTube where I don't even upload games or clips of games on this channel. It is straight up commentary, and if you ask me, that is 100% original content. Anyway, somebody at YouTube fixed the problem, and we're up and running again. And if you didn't know, we have another website called ly.news, where we mainly write articles on that website, so check it out. So by now, you've heard the horrible news. Luis Arreno is going to require Tommy John. Now, a lot of people out there are saying, why didn't the Yankees detect this earlier? Obviously, Luis Arreno was out basically the whole season last season. You would think that red flags would have been raised when Luis Serrino complained about his forearm acting up during the playoffs, during the 2019 playoffs. So I don't know what's up with the Yankees medical staff. Obviously, they made a whole bunch of changes, but we're talking about doctors here. And looking at all these players that went down in 2019, and it's continuing to happen in 2020, I mean, hmm, put two and two together. I think somebody's not doing their job correctly. Anyway, you slice it. It's unfortunate. So let's just move on. For Yankees fans out there, don't be too sad. As Luis Serrano was out last season as well, and the Yankees won about 103 games. Also, it was a harder blow as Luis Serrano was basically the Yankees' ace. This season, it's not the same. We have Garrett Cole. So, expect the Yankees to be the Yankees still. Obviously, with Luis Serrano on your rotation, it makes the Yankees better. But the Yankees are still going to be winners as the Red Sox and the Astros are going to have weaker teams this season. And the Yankees are just going to coast along. The only teams that they should look out for are pesky teams like the Rays, Twins, etc., etc. Even sleeper teams like the A's. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen, but I know the Yankees are still going to have a superb team in 2020. So... Here's something to be excited about. The Yankees have a whole bunch of young arms ready to take the ball. Who's going to replace Luis Arreno? Who's going to be that five guy? As how the rotation is looking like now, it's going to be Cole, Tanaka, Hap, and Monty. So, who are the young arms? Loisaga, Michael King, Luis Sessa, in my opinion, is a sleeper. He's never really been given a chance to be that guy that you develop in a rotation more like a journeyman pitcher at this point but he's a sleeper don't sleep on him you have David Hale you have the young stun from the Dominican Republic Garcia then you have Clark Schmidt the Yankees in my opinion are going to be straight you have Domingo Herman coming back in June and let's not forget Chad Green the Yankees are going to be all right do I believe the Yankees are going to make a trade early for a starting pitcher? I believe not. I believe they're going to do the same thing they did in 2019, where they're going to use a bullpen arm to start the game at times. But um, the Yankees have nothing to worry about. They have a whole bunch of young studs, and I'm pretty excited to see one of these guys like Garcia or Schmidt or even King have a shot at the opening day rotation. And obviously, Paxton as well comes back in June. But I do believe that if the Yankees want to win the World Series and go deep during the playoffs, that they will make a trade at the deadline for an ace, an ace caliber pitcher. I mean, Serrino is great. I love the guy. Everybody loves the guy. But he's going to be out till 2020, most of 2021. He's going to be out for a long time. So the Yankees have to pull the trigger in my opinion, at the deadline for a ace caliber arm. So Yankees fans, what do you guys think about this news of Luis Serrano going down? Is there light at the end of the tunnel? Who do you look forward to taking that five spot? Leave your opinions in the comment section below. And like always, this has been Felix from NYNews.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you out next time. Before it hits